Welcome, Quinn Global, Carl from uh, Quinn. We have just laid this VCL vapor control layer using the QDEC 2400, which is the self-adhesive uh, primer. Uh, can be used with the petuminous membranes, but we're moving on to uh, the QD 3001, which is the latest insulation adhesive available, and we're going to bond this Kingspan TR27 insulation board to this parapet vertical surface uh, with the adhesive. Here we go. On the gun, you have an adjustment screw at the back here. You can wind it out to increase the flow rate, or you can wind it in to reduce it. Here we go, and we're going to apply the adhesive down here. Nice, consistent beads. Again, 150 mil in, 300 on center. Leave that for a few moments, approximately two minutes, two to three minutes, depending on ambient conditions, and then offer up to the wall. Okay, so now we've got the boards, we've waited a couple of minutes and we're going to simply just offer these boards up to the wall. Uh, and obviously you've got a bit of movement as well, so you can just, you know, just pu push them in like that. We're have it, doing the same on this side, offering it up. Bringing it in and just pushing it up. And then we have the boards. Leave it for three to five minutes. Once that's then done, give them another push in and that will allow them to build their strength and increase the cure cycle. So this is applying QD3001 onto the field area in preparation to lay Kingspan TR27 tissue faced insulation boards. 150 million from the edge. Nice consistent bead of adhesive. Approximately 50 to 75 mil wide. So we're now going to place the um, insulation boards and just lay them onto the adhesive. For the purpose of this, we are going to have straight runs of insulation, not stagger them like you would do in the field. So lay the adhesive in, lay the boards into the adhesive. without applying too much pressure, just the weight of the board. And after five minutes, just walk them in. Okay. Oh, a bit far, but don't worry about that. We'll keep them going. 300 mil on center. placing them in.
Right, walk the boards in three to five minutes after the application of adhesive. This adhesive doesn't continue to rise, therefore you only have to walk the boards in once.